so we already have a form on which we have email date of birth qualification nationality photo and the save button is in place now we shall do storing the data to the server now we shall demonstrate how this data can be taken to the server and stored there including the file that is uploaded here so let us see what we already have we have this form validations are all in place and now what we have to do is we have to take this data to the server so what we would first of all want is a small message like thing here so that when the user clicks save and no photo is uploaded then a message should appear here please upload a photo or if he saves successfully then a message should appear here data saved so this is one thing that we need here we need a display here so that it conveys messages that are coming from the server for this we'll come and add we shall now uh, this is the place where we can fit that uh, label this is the input button and just after that we can put the label here but uh, how will that information come here this is our controller this one we plan to send that information in a view bag that view bag can be read there so for example if model is valid we can write view bag dot status is equal to record saved and else if it is not valid then we can write some error record because that we need not show here because validations will take care of that so uh, the point is that we are going to store message coming from the action method in a variable called status we shall read that variable here and display the message so how will we do if string dot is null or empty view bag dot status if not if it is not null or empty then we can write a div here and here we can write at the rate view bag dot status you can always format it by adding suitable css classes here to give it in red color or whatever you want that message will appear accordingly here so this is our controller where we have added that message and we can test it first we can test that message first whether it is appearing or not so it will come in a moment and we can write a at the rate a dot com date of birth can be chosen to be let us say something around three and then we can pick one of them and click save so the message has appeared here record saved now uh, this is okay we have an understanding that we can uh, write the saving code here into database and then record will be saved but before going there one important thing is like uh, how to check whether the file has been uh, uploaded or not so that data is not saved if no file has been selected by the user this is your uh, uh, this is your uh, that editor template where we have that file upload button we have to test at the server end whether this file appeared or not okay here before going to that point i would like to tell